Yo, what's going on guys? Rapid Plays here, and I know that this is back-to-back -back days of Hoi 4, and I hope you guys are completely okay with that, as we do not really have another series to go off of here. Um, if we do, if or if you guys can think of another series that I should do, of course let me know. I will definitely be looking into doing another series here soon, starting one up. Um, but yeah, I just need to know what you guys are thinking, what you guys want to see. If you guys do want to see a Rome 2 campaign, we can do that. If you guys want to see an Attila campaign, we can do that. Um, it's just really all of what you guys want to see. Um, I will do my best to do. Anyhow, um, things are going very interesting, aren't they? Um, we are kind of at a point right now where we are stalemated. Um, we either need to, one, do something that will allow us to... How do I put this? Absolutely smash the enemy into the ground. Or, two, we need to invade somewhere new and get more resources. Because right now, our current resources is not good at all. Um, we need rubber really badly. Uh, I think we talked about that a lot in the last video is how badly we need rubber. So, and I know I talked about invading Persia, then going to the British Raj, but I feel like I could get bog bogged down in Persia, especially with how little supply there is going to be here. Um, I mean, we can go to supply map mode and you can very clearly see that there's supply here, supply here, and that is it for the entire state of Persia. So that would be an issue. For one, um, we might be able to rush them down, then rush into the British Raj. But at the same time, the British Raj does have quite a few troops at this point in the game. So again, still just a little bit hesitant about that. Um, we could realistically... Wait, is there synthetic rubber? Naval dockyards, synthetic oil. No, there's not. Dang. All right, um, let's look around here, see what our infrastructure is maxed out. Wow. Wait, not our infrastructure, our buildings, but oh my goodness, our infrastructure is also pretty much maxed out at this point. Wow, that is kind of insane, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> our nation is doing amazing right now. Now, the biggest issue that we're having is how long this war is being drawn out for. Um... And there's not really anything we can do about it. I mean, look, we're at 41% war support. And it is just not... It's just not going very well for us war support-wise. So, we just need to do... We just need to end this war, pretty much, is what I'm trying to get at. Is we seriously need to end this war. And, I mean, we could go down here and start to fight in the African campaign with one of our armies. That probably wouldn't be a bad idea, actually. So let's go. Let's go start to fight in Africa. Um, see if we can't help out down here a little bit. Because if we can, I'm going to. Um, yeah, if we if we can help in Africa, we are going to blitz through Africa. Because Africa would actually probably be a pretty nice place to blitz through. Because um, this would be wiping out a lot of what's left of everyone's resources from the allies, I believe. Right? Uh, wood. I mean, France would be losing all of what's left of its resources. Belgium would be losing a lot of rubber. And then, yeah, South Africa has 480 chromium. That's kind of gross. <laughs> that is kind of gross, I'm not going to lie. Um, but other than that, I mean, the boys are attacking everywhere, but we seriously need to finish this war. This war is not going well at all right now for us. Um, it's just becoming a very long, drawn-out stalemate, which we cannot really afford to have. By any means, we cannot really afford to have a long, drawn-out stalemate. Where is this? Oh, just more, more Pacific action. Um, what we do really need, though, is, you know, Germany to do something with its navy and try to clear out the strait. Because if they were to clear out the strait, that would probably help a lot. And yet, they are not going to do that. So. Yeah, we're in, a, we're in quite the fun situation here of a stalemate. Um, oh yeah, look, they're already blitzing across 
Africa like it's nothing. My guys are. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. <laughs> Keep blitzing, boys. Keep on blitzing. Help expand the Spanish Empire. Help them expand. <laughs> Jeez, I'm Pete's. How many troops are over here? That's kind of insane. <laughs> Uh, I mean, America is running pretty low on supply, though. I'm not going to lie. Um, they are not doing too well on supply. That is also kind of insane. <laughs> that is quite nuts. I'm not going to lie. I, I keep saying I'm not going to lie, but, like, it's... Wow. <laughs> what some of these guys have is crazy. Uh, let's see if we can't surround him here, actually. Uh, capture this port. Give our guys some more supply down here. There we go, look at that. The boys got more supply. Head down here. Head down here and start taking stuff. Alright, let's collapse this unit here. Um, and yeah, the boys are still just blitzing across the continent. Which is amazing. Keep blitzing. Keep on blitzing. <laughs> and there goes that unit. As we just keep on invading Africa. Things are going great. Things are going absolutely peachy for us. Push into there. What is this? Liberia? 145 days for that. I don't... I don't really know if Liberia is worth that. <laughs> I don't I don't think Liberia is really worth that weight, so we're just going to keep on doing what we're doing here, which is just walking through all of the enemy lands in Africa, because our army is massive, and we just smash through their front lines. So yeah, just keep on walking down to every single port. But yeah, it's pretty much just us walking down their units in Africa, which is great. Something that we love to see. Um, I'm going to delete your current offensive line and give you a new one all the way down to here. And because we're still going to have absolutely zero resistance, and I want you to do that. <laughs> oh, yeah, look at this. The boys are just walking through all their ports down here. Jeez, I'm Pete's. Look how much of Africa we were able to conquer in just that little bit there. Oh, we're starting to come across a little bit of resistance. Starting to. Starting to see just a little bit. Nothing crazy. Nothing crazy resistance-wise, but we are starting to see some. Ooh. Starting to finish some of these techs. Ooh, we're really starting to finish some of these techs. Uh, can we even do anything? <laughs> can, can we even research anything without it just absolutely just shattering everything? Um, support companies. I guess we can start to do some support company stuff. Uh-oh. Resistance is starting to be met, guys. Resistance is starting to be met. After blitzkrieging across the entire Western Africa, we are just now starting to hit some resistance. You know what I could do? Actually, since we do have some cavalry brigades, I can actually make them, you know, not... Oh my god, these are horrible. All right, give me a second here <laughs> to, to make these not absolutely horrendous. Um, switching that up for logistics. So we're going to go cav, 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 cav. And uh, la, 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 cav, cav. Bang, bang. There we go. So now those units are not absolutely just atrocious. But you know what is atrocious? Uh, the enemy. The, the enemy is really, really not good at all. And we are just eviscerating them everywhere. Uh, oh my goodness, we are in the positives for everything. Ladies and gentlemen, we've done it. We are officially in the positives for everything. Although we are currently losing 1k guns a day. <laughs> Probably in the hellhole that is Africa. In the hellhole that is conquering Africa. That's probably where we're losing 99% of these guns. Uh, if we can take this, we would be able to encircle all those guys. So, actually, let's see if we can't take this. 
That would be kind of cash money, just saying. That would be pretty cash money. Sure, I'm bored. Let's just start building infrastructure in Africa. <laughs> when, when you get bored and you have nothing better to do, you just start building infrastructure in Africa. There we go. Naval bombing effort. Let's go. Uh, v formation. Beautiful. Come on. Take it, take it, take it. Get in there, Cav. Get in there. I don't think they're going to make it in there beforehand, unfortunately, though. Unfortunately. Uh, yeah. Oh my gosh, we did. They're encircled. Attack them. Attack them and wipe them from the face of the planet. This is wild. This is wild what we're doing in Africa. This is straight up just Erwin Rommel warfare. Evan Rommel. No, 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 no. Go here. Get them, boys. Sick them. Sick them. Kill them all. Kill them dead. Encircle them again. Do another encirclement. Oh, it's devastating. Uh, and, and they're pulling all their troops out. Gosh dang it. <laughs> Maybe it's not quite as devastating as I thought it was going to be. <laughs> Anyways, though, we're still we're still doing our best. Um, there it is. Got this big encirclement up here. So I'm pretty much just going to tell our boys, yeah, just continue this attack. Because these guys are all but passing away right now. Uh, excuse me? I don't know who you think you are, but you're not going in that tile. That's my tile. Alright. What what are we missing? Why are you guys struggling logistics-wise? Oh. That's why. Um, we need more Gabagoo. So we're going to take some Gabagoo off of the Navy. And then we're going to go like this. We need more convoys. Start pumping out convoys, lads. We need them. We need a lot of them. Oh, look at that. Got all those units up there with that encirclement. Beautiful. I actually push you in here. Start pushing the lads. Start using these horses how they're supposed to be used. By uh, encircling units. See if we can circle these guys in this port. Get them horses. Get them now quickly. And we secured it. W. Alright, so now these guys are completely cut off. Help attack that. Um, are you guys all... Yeah, they're trying to move. But you see, we're coming across another problem called... Um, there is nothing in Africa to make my units move faster. <laughs> just as here. Africa is just not fun right now. It, it is just my troops dying on repeat. Uh, pfft, what do we even do? We, we could build railways and stuff. That would probably help. Yeah, just do that. Try to build some railways for the boys. There we go. Look at us. Look at us. Who would have thought? Who would have thought we'd be conquering Africa as Austria-Hungary? Who would have thought? <laughs> Alright, let's go check back here. Make sure that there's nothing going wrong behind us. Back on the old uh, home front. Let's see here. This is the exact same as it was before. Okay. And then everything else is the exact same as it was before. Especially down here. This is the exact same as it was before. <laughs> uh, and there goes another one of our convoys. Germany, do something, please. 33 ships, and you have 12 capital ships, and you are not attacking. Please, Germany, <laughs> I beg you, do something. I'm doing so much down here in Africa, and you're just sitting there doing nothing. Oh my goodness. Come on, man. 
Well, I mean, we're pushing very deep into Africa right now. I'm not going to lie. We are, we are very deep into Africa. And I mean, it's going well. We have armies pretty much just walking into enemy territory everywhere. So just need to keep doing that. Keep on walking through enemy territories, lads. Keep on going. And pushing more units back. Beautiful. Absolutely exquisite. Hey, attack this guy. Actually, I'll go here. On my horse to start uh start capturing some more stuff for us. I want you guys to go down here to that port. Surround them. Surround and engulf, lads. Surround and engulf. Which I think they are starting to do a little bit down here, maybe? They're trying. The, <laughs> the lads are trying. Uh, yeah, we're just... I mean, Africa's just... It's just Africa. There's really no other way to put it other than it's just Africa right now. <laughs> There's no other good way to put what's happening other than it's it's just Africa, man. I'm trying to get these guys surrounded up here, but I don't think we're going to be able to. But you know what we are able to do is take all of this rubber. I mean, it's not for us, but we're still taking the rubber. <laughs> that the allies won't have the rubber, so that's that's good. <laughs> Look at that. Look at the boys. Look at the boys. Out here just conquesting through Africa real quick. The mad lads. <laughs> here we go. Here we go. Alright, let's take the rest of this stuff here. It's not Let's not just leave all this up here for no reason. That would hurt my brain. Let's make sure we take all their territory down here, boys. Let's make sure all that territory is ours at the end of the day. Start taking some Belgian territory as well. Because why not? Because why not? And let's take this last piece of territory up top here. We can start swinging the boys on down. Bum, 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 bum. Yep, and you guys are all gonna die. Goodbye. You know what? Thanks for landing here, though. Really, it it's awesome when you guys just land here, so you guys can just immediately, you know, dissipate. It's really awesome when you guys just sacrifice your units for me. <laughs> just absolute dissipation. <laughs> just nothing left of that unit. Just absolute 100% dissipation. Right, let's see if we can't encircle some units here. I'd be kind of cash money if we did get some encirclements. I'm not going to lie. A little bit of cash money encirclements never hurt anyone. Alright, we have... We're going to need to move our offensive line again. Uh, just move it, like, here. Sure. Sounds good to me. Do your thing. Do we have another army just sitting around not really doing anything? I mean, I could always just take one of these armies off the Russian front, because we don't really, don't really need them here. What army is this? I could move him down to here and then have him push this way. That might not be a bad idea, actually. Hold on. Hold on. Bang. Then what if we went like this with this army? We like that. We like the sound of that a lot. Four divisions assigned to that. Excuse moi Hey, I'm telling you to go down to Africa. What are you doing? Why are you not going down to Africa? 30 divisions are assigned to it. There we go. I want them to push. I want you guys to push up here. Yeah. 
Yeah, baby. That's what we like to see. All right. So now that those guys are moving, we'll take this blue army and then we'll just move their line of defense down a lot. Like so. So there we go. Just keeping some armies on tabs with Russia. But all of our other armies are going to be moving down below here to uh, continue to annihilate what's left of the Allied presence in Africa. Right. We need more supply. We need more supply. Let's go and take Leopoldville. Sure. Oh, and there, go, there it goes. We, we now own Belgium's other capital. <laughs> Belgium is almost completely out of land in this game because of our African conquest. Which is kind of insane when you think about it. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> it, it is kind of insane. But here we are. Getting ye old, uh No supply let's play. It's pretty fun. Me personally, it's actually a favorite of mine to play with no supply. Oh, there goes five convoys. Goodbye. Where are you guys at? Are you guys almost here? Uh, n yeah, no, I, I don't know. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think the boys are almost here. What are we missing? We need more convoys. Uh, Cause all of our convoys are just being sunk immediately. See, that, that is an issue that we are coming across. That is that is an issue that is being seen right now. Right. You, I also want to shrink your front line. My good sir, your front line does not need to be that long. I'm going to take your front line and shrink it a lot. Uh, front line. Shrink it up to here. Oh, we can even shrink it a little bit more. Shrink it up to like there. Yeah, there we go. There we go. The boys. The boys are cooking. Ish. They've, they've stopped cooking a little bit because of the lack of supply. The boys. <laughs> the boys have definitely halted cooking for a little bit here due to lack of Wow. That is a pitiful... Do you see how little organization that unit... Look at how little organization some of these units have because they're fighting in Africa. Because <laughs> they're fighting in a place that they don't they don't really know what supply is. They just like... It's like a fabled subject to them. They're like, what? That's, that's a real thing? I never knew that. It's like, yes, guys. Supply is a thing. You guys just don't have access to it. <laughs> so there we go. All right, we're going to move our units back down here. Uh, see if we can't give this guy an attacking entrenchment. Yeah, we'll actually do the entrenchment speed here. It'll help him a lot after he takes a territory. Uh, inventory attack. Yes. All right. Uh, la, la, la. Air innovation focus. Um, guess we're doing submarine effort now. Let's go. Even though we're not making submarines, and I don't plan on making submarines, we're doing the submarine effort. Oh, what happened? Actually, I think I did that to my own units, I'm not going to lie. I, I think I killed my own units here. Um, well, we're we're going to be able to break them out. Break the boys out. Yeah, we did it. Look at that. We're him. We're him. We saved them. We saved the boys. Well, all of our army is starting to show up now in Africa to attempt to help fight. Um, keyword is attempt. Um, whether or not that's really going to happen is kind of uh, up to chance here. It's really just up to chance. <laughs> like it's just, it's just not good. Um, can you? Can we like keep attacking here, boys? Oh, wait, no, we can't because all my units are still shuffling around. Because, yet again, we are fighting in Africa. And there's no way for my units to move around fast at all. <sighs> this is fun. This is, this is so much fun fighting in Africa. I'm loving it. It's amazing. It, it makes me smile a lot. It makes me smile a tremendous amount. 
as you can tell by my absolute monotone voice, I am completely lying about that. <laughs> I am absolutely 100% lying about that. Uh, so much fun. Attack this guy. Delete him. My cav divisions are actually good now, so... Delete them from existence. Oh, and there goes the last of uh, France down here. <laughs> France is pretty much all but gone. They're going to be living in Madagascar now. France is, France is now Madagascar. Gotta love it. What is this? No convoys have access. Yeah, I'm not... I'm not really surprised by that. I'm gonna be honest. I'm not... <laughs> I'm not... I'm not very surprised by the fact that our convoys can't do anything right now. Um, because you see, for that, we need naval supremacy for our convoys to be able to function. That and we need convoys in order for, you know, convoys to be able to function. And we have neither of the two things I just listed. We don't even have convoys for us to do things with. All right, you guys holding up here? You guys better be, because I'm, I'm putting in the Lord's work down here in Southern Africa. If you guys aren't holding, that is, that's pitiful. It's very pitiful. You guys, attack. What are you doing? What are we doing here, huh? This is an offensive war, not a defensive one. Attack, I tell you. Attack, with all due haste. How are, how are our logistics doing? Uh, they're... They're something. They're... <laughs> they, they're something. Our logistics are a thing that exists. It might not exist in this world, but it exists somewhere. Um, we need supply, and this is kind of the only place that has it. So if you guys could start attacking that, that'd be great for me. Push them back, lads. Push them back. Alright, I don't... Look at this. Our army's just... Or our navy's just passing away. Oh, can you guys, like, repair somewhere else? Oh, they are. Beautiful. Please, repair. Look at them. Look at the boys. Out here repairing and stuff. Look at the lads. Absolute mad lads. Out here repairing their ships. Pfft. What a bunch of legends. What a bunch of absolute legends. Dude, our fleet is so bad. <laughs> it is just horrendously bad. We have no capital ships. Just a bunch of destroyers and light cruisers. Alright, how are things going down here? Are we... Are, are we still having supply issues? Why am I even asking if we're still having supply? Yes, we're having supply issues. Because we're still fighting in Africa. I don't, I don't even know why I asked if we were still having supply issues. That's like... That's like the most dumb question ever. <laughs> I... Uh, and they have air superiority. With like two planes that are just fighter planes. Okay, fun. <sighs> we are running across the map, trying to do something that is impossible, which is capture Africa. So much fun and enjoyment in this. Bum, 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 ba da bum, bum, ba da bum, bum. Alright, actually no. Horse, keep snaking. Keep snaking all their territory. Because slowly but surely, we are... We are surrounding units. Alright, very slowly. But we are. And look at this. Look at the lads doing stuff out here. Absolute legends. Absolute legends of the scene. Keep pushing down the coast. Keep snaking all their territories. I mean, look at this. Look at that. I mean, look at that. We're kind of him. I'm not going to lie. We are kind of him. 
when it comes to, uh, you know, Africa. <laughs> when it comes to just walking through 90% of Africa and then, you know, no supply, funny moments. That are not funny, but they are moments. I like how they're still trying to save their allies and stuff down here. They're like, no, you can do it. Hold on for a little bit longer. Just, no. You cannot hold on for any longer. You will capitulate eventually. Uh, doctrines. Escort. Sure. Why not? <laughs> oh, boy. This is just... This is just turning into one big stalemate because we're not... Germany's not doing anything with their name. What are you even doing here, big dog? Aviation effort, brother. At this point, we're going to get to 1936 and just be playing normal Hoi 4 again. <laughs> like, we're getting to the point where normal Hoi 4 is just a large possibility because of how long this is taking. Ha! Ha! Ha ha! Ha! Hey, man. You're about to lose all your guys. You're about to have five divisions get bleeded. Yeah, not deleted. They're getting bleeded. Thank you. I'll be here all week. Me and my uh, inability to speak English. <laughs> oh my, look at this. They just have guys everywhere now. Just ain't good, Chief. Just, just ain't good. Hey, give me that darn supply hub. Give it to me. We need the port. Even though we don't have convoys, give me the port. I want it. And I want it now. Uh, dude, I'm just going to send you guys to die in that sea. Goodbye. It's nice knowing you. It's nice knowing you, Navy. You know, can't wait to watch that entire another fleet just pass away. Wow, we are still somehow pushing them back in a lot of territories. Still don't know how. If you asked me how, I would genuinely not be able to tell you. Oh my god, you see how fast we disintegrated that unit? Oh my god. That unit is gone. Never to be seen again. Oh my goodness. That's insane. Alright, well, we did split them in two, thankfully. This front is so large for this one army, and half the units are still back here trying to kill these guys. Hey, everyone here, attack. There we go, look at that. Look at that, and there goes our navy. Oh! Oh! 24! Oh. 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 I think it's safe to say that we are not going to be winning this game navally by any means. I think it's safe to say that Navy is just off off the table. It's just non-existent for us. Oh my goodness. Did you see that? That is insane. Uh, hey. Keep driving your car through Africa. You're having a fun time, trust me. Trust me, this is really fun and enjoyable for all of us right now. <laughs> I think fighting in Africa genuinely has to be my least favorite part of this game. The, this part of it right here is just sadness. That's all you get from this part of the game is just sadness. A feeling of emptiness. Yes, please attack them. Do we have any resources? <gasps> what is this? Why? Oh, because we don't have convoys. Got it. Got it. <laughs> okay, I understand why now. No convoys. Um, right. Hey, if we take that, guys, we can have some supply. Be pretty, be pretty cash money of you guys. But anyways, I think I'm going to end this episode off here. We, this was actually pretty, a lot more productive of an episode as it, than I thought it was going to be. Because Africa is now kind of firmly in our grasp. I mean, if we lose Africa at this point, we're, we're chalked. Because there's almost zero chance we can lose Africa. Like, we've absolutely done insane amounts in Africa. 
I mean, we've almost pushed all the way down to South Africa. That's how much we've done. But yeah, guys, with that being said, I'd like to thank you guys all for watching. If you guys did enjoy it, of course, make sure to go down below, hit that like and subscribe button. Uh, we are getting close to 550 subs. I think we're like right around 540 right now, which is crazy because we were just we just hit 500. So you guys are absolutely killing it with the support. Um, and I yet again, I cannot thank you guys enough for that. So I like to thank you guys all for watching. If you guys did enjoy, like I just said, go down below, hit that like and subscribe button. Um, and if you got, just let me know what series you guys want to see next too, because I have, I have a couple things in mind, but if you guys are like, I really want to see this one series in particular, of course, let me know. I will do everything to, uh, make that series happen. Um, so yeah, I'd like to thank you guys all for watching. I'll see you all next time. Peace.